Well, I've looked from our mountain camera. You can see it is raining right now. And Lauren, this rain is going to last for some of us throughout the night. Yeah, we could see, still, still see some rain into the evening. So what we're watching here in the First Alert Weather Center will be maybe a few more isolated showers tomorrow. And then we have some mild temperatures all week long. And then the countdown to fall, well, it's on. We end this weekend, the month, or I should say, the season of summer, and we head into fall. So satellite and radar, pretty active out there. There's nothing severe. So that's good news. We're just getting some passing showers, a little bit lightning in some of these areas as we zoom on into the Denver area. We're dry for now. There's just a few little spots getting some showers, but you can see that's what we were just looking at there on our Evergreen Parkway camera. Uh, that cell of some heavier rain rolling through some scattered showers down to the southwest as well. We have had some snow out there. Actually, you see that dark purple popping up in those San Juans. That is some heavy snow on some very high peaks out there. And then we have scattered showers up in northern Colorado as well for our northern and central mountain areas. So it's starting to fade out. It's not quite as widespread as it was, but we are are getting some great rain. We could really use it and we won't be seeing rain for a little while after we get past tomorrow. So future cast for tonight. Again, we continue to see some showers tomorrow morning. We wake up to sunshine and this rain's not going to last really probably too much past midnight if it's still sticking around until that time. And then tomorrow we see some building cloud cover and you'll notice a few kind of little green blobs passing through there. That is a chance for some rain. It's very slim out there, not nearly as widespread as today. Overall, most of Colorado is going to be dry on Wednesday. Right now, it's 77 in Denver but we did hit 83 today, 70 in Boulder, 73 in Fort Collins. It was 90 earlier in Lamar, lots of mid to upper 80s out east. We have the 40s and 50s, even still some 60s in parts of the high country, 46 in Frisco, 64 in Steamboat, 80 over in Grand Junction, and we have 52 from our weather watcher, Kimberly Novich, who lives in Como. Now let's take a look at our temperatures tomorrow. Not too much change, 82 in Denver, 83 in Greeley, uh, 82 in Fort Collins, lots of upper 80s out on the eastern plains, 60s, low 70s in the high country, 70s, 80s off to the west, and a lot of low 80s across the front range tomorrow. 83 in Greeley, 82 in Hudson, and here in downtown Denver, 80 in Centennial, 81 in Longmont and Loveland, and as we zoom on into parts of Douglas County, slightly cooler here. We're looking at 77 in Castle Pines and the Pinery, 78 in Castle Rock, 80 in Highlands Ranch, and taking a look at our super seven-day forecast. Thursday, mostly sunny, pretty much statewide. It's going to be lovely out there, maybe still a few isolated showers in the high country, then Friday, we drop down to the 70s. It's not a crazy cool down, but we will drop down to about 78 in Denver. 79 is the normal, so this actually puts us right where we should be. Upper 80s in the southeast, 60s for the most part in the high country, lots of 70s off to the west. And then on Saturday, fall officially begins at 1249 in the morning. So we're kind of easing into fall with some beautiful temperatures. Last year at this time, we still had lots of 90s out there. We were well into the 90s uh, throughout September. It was one of our top three three years for uh, 90 degree temperature 76 on Sunday. So this weekend really gorgeous mid 70s, lots of sunshine out there and then into next week 80 on Monday and we stay in the 80s through next week. So like I said, after we get past tomorrow and those isolated rain chances, we really don't see rain chances coming our way for at least another week. That's nice to have the sunshine for a while. Yes. <laughs> With those nice temperatures. Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. Lauren, thank you. We'll update a